It sounds like something out of an Alfred Hitchcock movie. Birds swooping down and attacking people in a tri-state park. Nine on your side reporter Scott Wegener takes us where our feathered friends aren't so friendly. How could a walk in Westchester's Voice of America Park on a sunny day give you anything to worry about? Marianne Surface and Jaquita Raleigh say a little bird told them. I have a beak and I can bite you. <laughs> Owen Knapp just saw the sign. It just had a bird on it and said beware. In the springtime, the uh, red-winged blackbirds come back in. They nest all over our park here. During nesting season, it doesn't take much for these birds to get their feathers ruffled. We get complaints all the time that, hey, birds are attacking. And while it isn't as bad as Hitchcock would have you believe, Jaquita says the males definitely consider themselves 500-pound canaries. He really um, let us know vocally that he was not happy with us being there. They tend to get swooped at, sometimes pecked at, landed on. Matt Stevens says these guys are very territorial. The red-winged blackbirds uh, are just telling them, hey, this is my area, move on. Still, little Owen Knapp isn't intimidated by the sign. No, I wasn't worried. And with good reason. I don't know how to read. Maybe what he doesn't know can't hurt him. Bird watching experts say the nesting season could last throughout the entire summer. So until the leaves start to change, you may want to keep your eye out just to be safe. Scott Wegener, not on your side, Westchester. Authorities at the park say the birds aren't dangerous, but they do advise guests to stay on the marked paths. Good advice. And whether